if you want to talk about a real first validator I had, was Marek Konevska directed a movie called Less Than Zero. Right. Marek Konevska hated the studio system so much that the minute he was done directing Less Than Zero, buggered off, never to be bothered at interacting with a major studio's take on what a movie with a message and some heart and some depth was supposed to be by the time it made it to market. So he was also super critical in my development because his process of getting ready to shoot something was unlike anything I'd ever experienced before. Also, when I came on the set, I think it was one of the first days of shooting, I'm supposed to be telling my dad on a, on a tennis court that he, if he could let me come stay back at the house, it would mean a lot to me and I'd run out of all my options and stuff. And it was the first time that I ever walked onto a film set and the director told everybody to stop what they were doing, be quiet and concentrate because what I was going to do was going to be special and it was going to be difficult and it was going to be their fault if I wasn't able to get there, basically. Really? He set it up so that I felt like, oh, this is important and now I have to do my part. So he gave you some stakes. He gave me some stakes and, uh, and he knew I was, I was pretty nutty, but he believed in my talent. And, and in that moment, I had to develop a system by which I could go from zero to 60 so people weren't just standing around until I felt it, which is also critical. It's like a great chef. Uh, two most important things, sense of urgency and attention to detail. Without a sense of urgency, you're never going to be able to survive in the film industry because they're not 112 hour days until you're feeling yeah. it, they're 12 hour days. And in that moment I thought, okay, what's my little half early to mid 20s system? And it was, will any father and son ever really be able to connect and understand each other? And five seconds later I went and I was able to do the scene. Now, Mara Konevska was able to give me the space to have to come up with something that was indelibly watchable and believable in a scene by saying even though there's a sense of urgency and we have to have an attention to detail, I am stopping the world right now on this tennis court so that you can dig up the goods and bring it to bear. And I never ever forgot that. Hey folks, thanks for watching. If you like what you just saw, then why not subscribe? Click right here for lots more off camera. And if you want to see the hour long version of these conversations, I'm going to give you the secret link. Here it is, offcamera.com. Check it out. <laughs>